This is DHS Game Time Roundup with Pep Fernandez. Powered by Paradise Chevrolet Cadillac. Standards for excellence. Supa Dupa Harupa Valley does it again. Welcome to the HS Game Time Roundup. I'm your host, Pep Fernandez. The Jaguars continue to dominate the Sunkiss League. We'll have highlights of Harupa Valley taking on Patriot, but we lead off the show in the land of the Big Eight, where Corona was on the verge of knocking off North. Could the Panthers hand the Huskies their first league loss of the season? Fourth inning, J-Dubs, Jack Johnson singles and brings in Andrew Saucedo, and the Huskies had a 6-1 lead. But you can never count out Corona. In the fifth, Connor Christner, who homered earlier in the game, belts a two-run double, and that made it a 6-4 ball game. Still in the fifth, bases loaded for Matt Major. Time to man up. Major swats the grand slam to left field, and the Panthers take the lead 8-6. The Corona rally continued in the fifth. Zach Cavasso slaps the single to right. In comes another Corona run, and the Panthers go up 9-6. Bottom of the fifth, North starts chipping away at that Corona lead. Gabriel Franca flies home on the wild pitch, making it 9-7. Later, the Huskies with men aboard. Gage Cotton grounds out, but Tino Reyna scores on the play, and North was down 10-8 at that point. Later in the sixth, Franca grounds to short. The fielder's choice allows Anthony Ortega to score, and it's now just a one-run game to the seventh. North trailing 10-9. Runners on second and third for Jack Johnson, and he ropes a double to center field. Two-run score. North wins walk-off style, 11-10, your final score. North improves to 8-0 in the Big 8, 18-3 overall. Corona falls to 4-4 four four in league. And how about this one from the land of the Big 8? Santiago tosses the shutout at King, 8-9 of the final. The Sharks are 3-5 in league, while King drops to 5-3. You knew it was just a matter of time until the roundup made its way to see Supa Dupa Harupa Valley. The Jaguars are running away with the Sunkiss League. Could Patriot knock off Harupa Valley? The Warriors coached by Brian Kennedy, the brother of Major Leaguer Adam Kennedy. First inning, the Jaguars go right to work. Merrick Petito singles to right and Mike Rios darts for the dish, slides in and he is safe. Later in the opening frame, Daniel Andrade slaps a base hit up the middle. That would plate Hector Lujan, making it three zip Jaguars. Still in the first, Giovanni Lopez sends the flare to right field. It falls in, and Andrade scores. Harupa Valley on top for nada. Bottom of the first, Patriot gets one back. Mark Lazinski grounds to short, and Tristan Mercado crosses the plate. The Warriors are on the board. Fast forward to the third, Petito on the bump for the Jaguars and rolling along, strike three, and check out the umpire. I see blue, he looks glorious. Bottom of the third, Mark Kiro sends the sack fly to right. Martin Mercado tags up from third, and he's going for it. Mercado is in there, and it's five to one, Harupa Valley. Later in the third, Rios going to the gap, picks up some khakis, a nice leather belt, and a two-run double into the gap. Supa Dupa Harupa Valley wins 8-4 your final. The Jaguars are now 9-0 in the Sunkiss, 15-2 overall this season. And the Inland Empire Track and Field Championships are Saturday at Vista Murrieta High School. Sports writer Miriam Swanson has you covered, so check back with HS Game Time for results from the meet. I'm Pep Fernandez for the HS Game Time Roundup.